Hey y'all, welcome back to part two. This is a really nice hand sculpture and it's a little seating space that you can sit in. Loads of seating spaces and each and every seating space is perfect for pictures. This huge bird, are these fairies? Let's see. It's so pretty here. I just, ugh, so beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Look at the little man. I've always seen like the women fairies. I've never seen one that was like a man. I really do like that. Oh, they're friends to the end. I love it. It has such a kitty vibe to the to this place. I feel like this would be a great place for a first date because it's like fun. Not so much kitty, but it's fun. It's a really nice like, oh, ah, look at this. So you can come with your date and just really explore. And you guys get to see like what one person thinks is beautiful compared to the next. Or if you guys both have the same type of feel when it comes to what you like as far as things being like enchanted and things like that. This cute little house with the mom and the dad and the little baby. The tail of Timmy Tiptoes. Oh, She got her little bow. She like, yo, that's my bae. And it's our baby. So cute. I love it. Look at this. Are these bunny rabbits? Super cute. I love this. Then they have the little mushroom house. The mushroom house is adorable. Super duper cute. These flowers are like my favorite flowers ever. I feel like, hey, if I keep saying them, I'm going to take that as a sign that I'm supposed to get some. You know, where, where would they go? I don't know. I get a lot of things and they just sit in my inventory until I'm like, you know, when I, when I want them, I'll, I'll have them. This is a really nice space. I really, really like this. They have all of the books. Not today's lesson, how to avoid cats. That's a fabulous lesson when you are a mouse. Super cute. They have the little tree with the books. Oh, this is so pretty. I love spaces like this. I love, love, love just being able to see all the different types of enchanted spaces. I've never gone to an enchanted space that was quite like the other. And I really, really admire that about the creators. I don't know if they check out other people's um, enchanted lands and are like, we're not gonna do our land like that. Or if they just simply have a different outlook on what they deem to be enchanted. This is adorable. This little chipmunk with the glasses, super cute. They're like, we found these. We don't really know what they do, but they're cool. And then we have another mushroom house. All of the colors are so, they're so vibrant. They just go so well with the shared environment. They go so, so well with the shared environment. I love this. So everything is very strategic. I can tell. I can tell because, so they have like this purple house and the pink flowers and so they have the little birdies at the top but then they added white flowers over here or like pale type flowers pastels that's the word i'm looking for like pastel type flowers so that the space has color but it's not overbearing so just like this space alone i love it i love it everything is very strategic i love how this space feels very separate from the other spaces, almost as though this is like a little community that we've walked into. And I really like that. Is this like a fox with little mousy friends? They're just chilling. I love the birds. The birds are so nice and the beautiful, huge butterflies. Oh, I, I, I can't get enough of this. So they have nice little seating spaces up in the trees that you can go to. And then again, you can take pictures in these spaces and the pictures are going to be marvelous. 
because every single space is aesthetically pleasing and it's going to be perfect for pictures okay getting serenaded got somebody um, giving you some shade playing a little guitar and a bird like what are y'all doing over here y'all having y'all a good old time so then we have the little mushrooms and the mouse just chilling and the little pool on a little warm day they got their little drink adorable adorable i love these flowers and everything is so huge i'm tall as you guys may or may not know in second life i am like i'm tall in second life oh they're playing tennis and so all of these spaces are huge all the animals are huge so like this this mouse is my height which says a lot as to how large they have made the animals to make sure that everything is oversized they have the pizza with the little steam coming off are they grilling they are grilling y'all how cute is this what they got on the grill i know that's right they got some vegetables i know mm-hmm eating healthy as they should so they have the it's like every single little space i want to look at because everything is beautiful and this is how we explore you know the oversized blueberries and the oversized cherries i love it love it love it i love the mushrooms oh it's so cute here so this feels like I'm gonna say like a Sam. It might be more than that. I don't know if it's just because we went this way already. I don't know if it's just because there's so much to see every little step of the way where it feels like this is larger than a Sam, but it might not be. It might just be a Sam. I don't know. It's big. It's big. Not only is it big, but it's very easy to get turned around. Like if you go down one path, I could imagine it being easy to get turned around because initially I wanted to go to a different space and we ended up here. And this was a brand new space. I don't know where the space that I want to go to is located now, but you know, perhaps that's a, that's a space for you guys to come and explore on your own i love how they're like sitting here learning about mushrooms with like the pictures of the mushrooms and then the mushrooms on the mushroom books it makes me like not want to forget to kind of like pan up to see what else is going on they have this cute little merry-go-round seating where you can sit there the little love mice with the little smooch everything is so beautiful i want to look at this butterfly I love it. So when you guys come here, if you see a path, take it. Take it and make sure you guys take your time. We still I still want to look at some other things here. Look how cute this is. Uh, when I tell you. This is super cute. Super cute. So all the paths are very like twisty turny. So they have this space over here where they're over there in the boat and they're really like enjoying themselves in the little boat. They have so many nice seating spaces here. It's so beautiful. Everything is so beautiful. Look at these pretty flowers. I love it. I love how all of the spaces and the paths are so twisty turny. You just don't know what you're gonna see. What is this? Oh, this is pretty. Okay, wait, wait, wait. We're gonna we're gonna start over here. Is this a little water stream? Super cute. Look at that. Oh, beautiful. Okay, we're not we're not gonna go that way. We're gonna we'll go this way. We'll just we'll stick to this side. Even though I want to walk across everything, I want to leave some things for you guys to come and look at. 
OMG! Look at this! How beautiful! Oh, I love this. I love all the colors over here, how they're very neutral colors. And then they have like the sparkle trees. Look at this tree. It's giving wedding. I love all the sunbeams. And again, with the strategic coloring, now the butterflies are white. And then they have this beautiful space that has really, really nice pops of color. You can actually sit at this piano. Look how pretty these flowers are. Oh, I love it. These are like some of my favorite flowers. Look at this space. This looks so pretty and so enchanted with the flying papers and things like that. Wedding photos in this space would be amazing. To have a wedding dress on in that space, amazing. What does this look like? This is like a big, it's like a little water feature. Super nice. The top area looks like jeweled. Look how pretty this is. Oh, I love it. And then we'll go, what is, cause I want to see like what was up here. Yeah, it's like a little jeweled piece, super cute. And then she's animated, look at her. Oh, she's so dainty with like her little tiptoe on the pedal, just spinning around. I love that. And so in this space, they have the blue butterflies. And so they have the white butterflies in this area. And then they have the blue, the blue butterflies within that space. This is so pretty. More of these flowers, which I love. I love all of the like the little fly things. So they have sparkles and sun rays and little flying particles off of different plants everything is like enlarged the beautiful huge mushrooms this looks like a space that you could possibly sit at can you sit here you might be able to sit there i don't know that might just be the decorative way that it's made This space is beautiful. And then they have this, another beautiful unicorn. He's trying to run away from me. I'm trying to see you. Look at how beautiful this unicorn is. With the wings, it's not a unicorn with wings. What is it called? It's a special name for it. So I've had an amazing time with you guys at Luann's Magical World. The landmark for this place will be in the description box below. So make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys next time.